With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The given question says that find the area of a rhombus having each side equal to 15 cm and one of whose diagonals is 24 cm. So we are given one of the diagonals of the rhombus and we are given the the length of the side of the rhombus. We know that all the sides of the rhombus are equal. So we are given one of the sides of rhombus that is 15 cm and we are also given the length of we denote the we denote the side of the rhombus by a so a is equals to 15 cm we are given one of the diagonals we denote one of the diagonals by d1 and it is equal to 24 cm the other diagonal is not given so d2 is we are going to is what we are going to find out because because we ultimately we are supposed to find out the area of this rhombus and the area of the rhombus is half of product of the two diagonals that is d1 multiplied by d2 now we, we are going to use the formula there is a relationship between the side of rhombus that is a and the diagonal d1 and d2 and that relationship is a is equal to half under root d1 square plus d2 square now let's put in the values so the values are a is 15 centimeters so 15 is equal to half one of the diagonals is given the diagonal the length of d1 is 24 so 24 raised to the power 2 plus d2 raised to the power 2 now let's uh, simplify it so 15 multiplied by 2 will be equal to 24 raised to the power 2 is 576 plus d2 square under root is equal to 15 multiplied by 2 that is 30 now 30 is equal to under root 576 plus d2 square now squaring both sides so taking a square both sides we will have 30 raised to the power 2 on the left hand side and this square root will get cancelled out when we will we take a square of this of the terms that are present on the right hand side of the equation so we will have we will be left with 576 plus d2 square now 30 raised to the power 2 is 900 576 will go to the other side of the equation and we will have minus 5 minus 576 is equal to d2 raised to the power 2 now 900 minus 576 will be equal to 900 minus 576 is equals to 324 which is equal to d2 square now this square will go to the other side of the equation and we will have d2 is equals to under root 324 now 324 can be written as product of 18 two times that is 18 multiplied by 18 is equals to 324 so out of this square root this 18 will come out because 18 is forming a pair that means the length of the other diagonal is 18 now we are going to use the formula for area of rhombus and using that formula we are going to put the values of diagonals in that formula the formula is half multiplied by d1 multiplied by d2 d1 is 24 centimeter d2 is 18 so half multiplied by 24 multiplied by 18 which will give us 18 divided by 2 is 9 24 multiplied by 9 will be 20 multiplied 24 multiplied by 9 will be 216 so the length because the length of the diagonals are in centimeters so 216 centimeter square here also the diagonal is in centimeter so this is the area of the rhombus that we were supposed to find in this question that's all thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today